currently waiting to ID me with a trusted referee. Seriously, this has been like the worst experience on the computer ever. <laughs> I mean, I, luckily for me, yeah, I got a brain and I've got patience because this has been five days, five days, because I have to renew my claim with the EDD because of the coronavirus situation, you know, because the salon's still closed. There's nothing I can do about it. So anyway, because of all the scammers out there, um, now as people that didn't do anything were required to do this ID me thing, which entails apparently five days of proving who you are. Not only five days, but you have to upload like a thousand selfies. You have to upload a picture of your driver's license front and back. You have to upload a picture of your health card. You have to upload um, your phone bill, any utility bills you have in your name, passport, whatever. And then um, you still don't qualify. Apparently it's not confirmed. They can't confirm your identity, even with your phone numbers, even with your checking account. All of that, even though you already have an account with EDD, you got to do this ID me thing. And it says four minutes. Let me tell you, <laughs> I've been here five hours today alone, just waiting for that so-called one hour and 20 minute wait. It's been, yeah, over five hours. So hopefully at this point in time, they'll be able to confirm that it's me. <laughs> but you know, it would have been a lot easier if they just said upload, you know, a picture of your driver's license. And then, you know, maybe they could access your computer and take a picture of you next to your driver's license. And, but really, truly, I don't know how the average person is dealing with this because you have to have two computers, two, because, you know, in my case anyway, because you, your laptop has the webcam on it, your regular desktop does not, you have to do the codes and the emails and back and forth, and then you got to be able to answer this phone, your home phone real quick, so you got to have a home phone to get that code, and then you got to type it in, and then, because that's an office I don't know, two-factor authentication, whatever that word is. Um, and then, you know, you just keep sitting here waiting for them to tell you what to send next. But those, that thousand selfies, that was crazy. You have to keep doing this. Oh, too much light. Oh, not enough light. Oh, oh, oh. So, seriously, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry I need to file for unemployment because the governor shut down <laughs> my place of employment. And all you scammers out there, you know, I hope you're getting a chuckle out of this because those of us who, you know, are having to deal with this, we're not totally thrilled. And the, uh, yeah, the ID me, <laughs> it's a pain in the ass. Yeah, I'm just glad, like I said, I have patience and uh, the mentality and everything I need to confirm my ID. But uh, the average person, yeah, I, I don't know how they're dealing with this. I mean, there are people out there that, you know, they just don't have two computers. <laughs> they don't have two phones. They don't have all these IDs. And they don't have hours and hours and hours to sit in front of a computer waiting for that little camera to come on. I'm down to the last three minutes of having this video confirmation of who I am. But I got to have all of this ready to go to to show them. <laughs> just crazy. I just hope it, you know, the shit don't time out before this three minutes that's actually going to be about 30 minutes ends. All right, two minutes, yeah. It's going to be all I can do not to cuss them out when they come on camera. <laughs> okay, it now says zero minutes. <laughs> I'm, I'm waiting. It says connecting to your meeting. One moment, please. The screen will refresh after the ID me trusted referee agent has configured your video session. <laughs> okay, there's the camera. There's the person. Finally, hi. Can you see me? And just like that, it went off. I had her on camera, and she couldn't find me. And okay, so now she's it's right off. there. And apparently, she can't see me or hear me. There she Finally, is. she can't see me. I don't know why she can't see me. My camera is on. That's there, but she can't see me. I don't have Zoom. I don't have Zoom. I don't have Zoom. 
And there you have it. <laughs> Five days of waiting, and she can't see me for whatever reason from my camera. I just went to my camera settings, and there I am. So I don't know what's going on. I'm just going to have to, I guess, spend a few more days trying to verify my identity with ID me. Okay, I pulled myself up on ID me by clicking the link, but now the, I guess, the trusted referee is not there. <sighs> this is such a pain in the tush. And now I gotta redo the process all over again because it's been, I guess, abandoned. So now I gotta send him a picture of my driver's license, the front, the back. <sighs> All the documents, all yeah, over. Yeah, so it. back of the driver's license, and now it's going to say, okay, i got to take a bunch of selfies with, in the proper lighting. This is the hard part right here, having to take the selfies. Because, <laughs> you know, the lighting's... Yep, never... see? We were not able to complete your liveliness. Please ensure that your face is clearly seen. Avoid any backlighting. Try it too again. Too much light this time. Try it again. Again, too much light. You know, you go this direction, you go that direction, you go that direction. It's either too much light, too dark a light, and oh, now we got to start the process all over because you ran out of turns. You've reached the maximum number of live selfie attempts. Please go back to the browser and start the process. All over. There it is. Okay, start all over. Upload that driver's license again. Front and back. <laughs> I don't understand why you got to upload everything a hundred times to be verified who you are. Again, not able to capture your face. <laughs> you're not allowed to blink. You're not allowed to breathe. You're not allowed to move. And all these different lights go off. I mean, it's crazy. <sighs> I wish I liked taking selfies. This is no fun, I'm telling you, at all. Too much light detected on your face. <laughs> you know, I, I come in here to EDD because I have to come here in order to restart the process to file for that uh, ID me account that I'm required to have in order to file for EDD now. And it says, you know, you don't have to file, refile if you already have a PUA on it, on account. But then you click here. And, of course, the first thing it says is you got to file a new claim. So then you do that. And then, yep, there you go again. File a new claim. And then you got to answer a bunch of questions first. It, you know, you go like 20 different clicks. And then you're like, yes, no, no, I didn't. No, I haven't. I haven't. I haven't. I haven't. Yes, I filed last year. <laughs> and then on to your next one. And then... Click this, verify your identity, and then now you got to say, okay, now you got to call me. Continue. Now watch, I hit continue. The phone will ring in just three more seconds. See, it's spinning around because I have already given it my, you know, my home number and my cell phone number. Even, and for some reason, that doesn't confirm it's me. <laughs> Go figure, you know, so I'm, I'm required to give them the, the phone bill. So right now I'm waiting for it to, to call me on the phone here. And it says, hang tight, we're sending the code to your device right now. So hopefully it'll send it. Up oh, there it is. And then I got to type in the code. Sign in code is, and then click. And now I gotta do the rest of this part. It's sending my, it says, see, I'm filing for unemployment. And now I gotta send in my driver's license again in the back of the live. Let's see, verify your identity. Start now, upload those fucking photos. <laughs> your fucking front and back. It's crazy. So to all you criminals out there that have been stealing everybody's ID, I hope you're getting a really big chuckle over the fact that those of us who just need to verify who we are have to spend five days apparently proving who we are. Naturally, yeah. Sorry, but this site could not be reached. It has crashed again. <laughs> yeah, ID me. I'm telling you, you're not very easy user-friendly at all. 
five days is ridiculous to verify somebody's identity, not to mention how many hours that is invested and in resending you and resending you and resending you and resend a thousand pictures of me you need really truly and you need me to speak to you on the that over there and speak to you over on that phone and speak to Okay, it says wait time is now 30 minutes at the ID Me website. You know, I had to upload everything again. The driver's license, the insurance cards, my phone bill, all that stuff, phone number. And still, they need to look at me via their, I guess, website to confirm I am who I am. And it's <laughs> it's 5:30 now, and I got started at like seven this morning. So uh, they, their clock clearly is not the same as my clock because originally it said an hour and a half, and it was four, almost five hours before I actually had the opportunity to almost <laughs> speak with somebody on the other end. But unfortunately, they didn't see me or something. I don't know. I just know that. You know, I'm going to try it again because I do need to log on to that EDD website and file that claim again since the governor shut down the salon. You know, I, I do need that unemployment if I can get it. So, yeah, I'm hoping <laughs> that this next half hour ends up only being an hour and a half, not five hours. Ah, okay, it says six minutes. It's now 6.30. I am starving. <laughs> I need dinner. I hope this camera don't go on when I'm trying to eat. <laughs> okay, it says I got one minute left, so I think I'm going to go ahead and turn on this light. Okay, it says it's connected me to the meeting. <laughs> I hope it is. And finally, somebody. <laughs> Robin Lisa Kelly. Okay, but I'm, I'm verified now. It's over with, right? Yes. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Thank you. Uh, the video session with the ID Me Trusted Referee has ended. Whew. <laughs> I really, truly, that was difficult. Um, the, the individual I spoke with, that wasn't difficult. He was very, very nice. Actually, he probably saved the day <laughs> by just... Let me try to figure out how to do this because, you know, when he called me, my headphones, unfortunately, I can't, I couldn't hear, or he couldn't hear me. I could hear him, but he couldn't hear me. And I went over here and tried to turn the volume up. That wasn't the trick, so I got to figure out, I guess, how to do it. I never really did a video chat before. <laughs> yeah, I got to learn how to video chat. So, yeah, got to learn because apparently this part doesn't work for me correctly. Um, and then he sent me an email, and of course there is no camera on that computer, <laughs> only on that computer. And then he tried sending me a text message or calling me on that saying, well, I can talk to you on your cell phone and then you can, you know, I can just look at him and he could tell me what to do. And that wouldn't work either because my phone rejects any number that isn't automatically in my phone book or is a... 800 number or 900, you, you know, unknown caller. My phone just automatically rejects it and it goes straight to voicemail. <laughs> so I wasn't able to do it. I'm like, can you can you call me on my actual phone, my landline? Yeah, call me when all else fails. Use a telephone. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's what it took. So um, he called me on the landline and then. He was able to talk to me while I was looking at him. And then he just had me show him everything I needed to show him. And that was it. It was done. So, yeah, the ID me uh, procedure is a pain in the ass. You know, it really is. But I guess once it's done, it's done. It's over with. And now I can finally go log on to the EDD website and refile my claim for the, uh, I guess, unemployment benefits that I'm entitled to or 
can maybe get because of the fact that the governor shut down the hair salon and, and we're not scheduled to be reopened anytime soon. So, yeah, I could use some of the money. So, <laughs> I'm hoping that, uh, you know, this ID me procedure is done and over with. And if it wasn't for all those criminals out there, I wouldn't have had to just spend five days and 12 hours today <laughs> waiting to do a video call with somebody to show them all the information. And again, I'm so glad I even had all the information because it, this whole thing required a landline, a cell phone, a laptop with a camera, a, a, a desktop, <laughs> and a whole bunch of proof that I'm who I am between the... I guess the 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 utility bills, uh, my driver's license, my insurance card, my social security card. Uh, it's a lot of proof you got to give to prove you're who you are. <laughs> oh, and then he took a you know a picture of me <laughs> from this computer just to confirm I'm the same person on the driver's license. So yeah, quite the adventure. <laughs> Good luck if you got to deal with it. <laughs>